สวัสดีครับ Good evening again and welcome to GPC International News. I'm Daniel Wu and this is the week's headlines. Toyota launches a brand new compact car concept. The new sedan is called the Toyota Corolla Furia car. Sanuk.com's auto website that regularly posts updates on cars at auto.sanuk.com says one of the world's most popular compact car sedan for decades has been and continues to be the legendary Toyota Corolla that has dominated sales charts of sedans around the world. The name holds a world record for the longest consecutive sales volume of all sedans and is probably the most important car in Toyota's lineup. Competition has already launched their new compact car sedans, and it's Toyota Corolla's turn once again with a brand new model, the Toyota Corolla Furia concept. The Furia concept has become talk of the town after it was unveiled at the Detroit Auto Show 2013, and images of this new model concept have been revealed to the public. But no one anticipated it to be a compact car with design, aesthetics, and performance that gives an early indication of where future compact car design just might be headed. This model is expected to debut at dealerships very soon. The newer modern design is very different from its predecessors. Over the years, Toyota Corolla has become either a more sporty or luxurious look. This time, a bold move toward a modern, futuristic style is what makes this model very interesting. The concept features narrow, almost sinister-looking headlights and a raked windshield, which makes it more stylish. And here's the best part, 19-inch alloy wheels. It also has piercing LED taillights and a much shorter front chassis that should assist a lot more in steering. The concept is 181.9 inches long in millimeters, that's just 4,620 millimeters long, and 71 inches or 1,805 millimeters wide, and only 56.1 inches or 1,425 millimeters tall. This car has a modern look, but the 2,700 millimeter wheelbase gives it a sporty driving style. All of those details will be included in actual cars at dealerships, not to mention the Toyota Corolla Furia concept looks a lot better than any other Corolla on the market so far. It's still only a concept car, but uh, news of the next model has yet to be officially released and we know it won't be long. Let's not forget the Corolla Furia concept looks a hell of a lot better than any other Toyota Corolla previously launched in the market. And although it's still just a concept car, we know it won't be long until the newest models are available at the dealership closest to you. Moving on now, the Global Fortune 500 annual survey has ranked Ferrari as the world's most powerful brand in 2013. The 2013 annual survey by Global 500 classifies Ferrari as the world's most powerful brand of today based on company revenues and brand equity. Ferrari is superior in both aspects when compared with other brands, including other products. Ferrari, which is owned by the carmaker Fiat, has received the highest ratings even though the organization isn't that large and has less financial value when compared with much bigger competitors in the automotive industry such as BMW, Volkswagen and Audi. Even though company revenue plays a large role in determining brand value, other aspects include revenue per customer, margins, advertising and marketing as well as other aspects. Although Ferrari is much smaller than its counterparts in terms of revenue, but the Black Stallion brand is superior in brand favorability and brand loyalty from its customers. Ferrari is the only automotive brand among the top five in the Global 500 survey. Runners-up are from other industries altogether, including Google, Coca-Cola, PricewaterhouseCoopers, and Hermes, the second, third, fourth, and five places respectively. Ferrari chairman Lucia di Montezemolo is quoted as saying, it's always a pleasure to top any list, and still more so when the competition includes some of the world's most famous companies. Behind this acknowledgement, he's quoted as saying, are exceptional products made by equally exceptional men and women. They made it possible, and for that I thank them. Those were comments by Lucia di Montezemolo, chairman of Ferrari. And that's your wrap-up of GBC International News. Don't go away. We'll be right back with more.
Welcome back to GBC International News. We're keeping you up to date on news and current events in the motor business broadcast around the world. And now to our next story. Honda has announced that it will launch a brand new hybrid car this year and hopes to sell 7,200 vehicles of this model. Honda launches the new Honda Civic Hybrid to address the need for energy-saving and earth-friendly green cars. Honda expects more than 7,200 cars will be sold this year. New Honda Civic Hybrid comes with projector lights in blue rims, LED rear lights with clear blue lens, rear spoiler, specially designed alloy wheels with smart technology and perfect safety systems to give you peace of mind while on the road. Honda is also powering this eco-friendly car with lithium-ion batteries made in Thailand for its hybrid vehicles for the very first time. The 1.5-liter iVTEC engine releases very low carbon gas emissions thanks to the smart te technology, but it's also a stylish and sleek look. This new Honda Civic Hybrid will certainly receive a warm welcome by environmentally conscious users, but its aesthetic and sporty design should also attract potential buyers who appreciate technology delivered with style. Let's take a look at the price tag. New Honda Civic Hybrid is available in two versions. Hybrid model is priced at 1,035,000 baht and hybrid Navi model just slightly higher at 1,095,000 baht. There are three colors to choose from. Orchid white, that's more similar to pearl white. Frosty white, that's white with a nice metallic finish. And alabaster silver, very much like metallic silver. There are two shades available for the interior. If you're interested in getting your hands on one of those eco-friendly Honda Civic hybrid cars, please don't hesitate to walk into a Honda dealership closest to you and ask for more information. And that brings us to closing at GBC International News. But before we end the program, we have an announcement to make. If you are shopping around for a brand new car, please don't forget to visit the 34th Bangkok International Motor Show, which will be held at the Impact Mung Tong Tani Challenger 1, 2, and 3, this March 27 to April 7, 2013. Tickets will be available at the gate until 9 p.m. daily. Thank you for watching Grand Prix Channel and uh, GBC International News. Our next program is Used Cars. See you tomorrow this time. I'm Daniel Wu. You're watching Grand Prix Channel. Sorry,